All right, in this video, we're gonna do the first two muscles of the medial thigh. We're gonna do sartorius and gracilis, and we're also gonna do this major blood vessel. In this cat, it's, it's injected spectacularly. This is the great saphenous, so we're gonna save that as it comes up into the femoral triangle. So we're gonna do all that at one time. So we got a little bit of connective tissue. Should not have a whole lot. If you do, clean that off first. So I'm just gonna go ahead and peel this little layer off. Now be careful in there, there's a lot of blood vessels and nerves right here in the triangle. So I'm just going to kind of work down until I get to the muscle. And I'll clean that area out later. So let me clean that off. Got my pile over here. Okay, so that looks better there. Got a little bit here. In fact, I'm probably going to use my probe for this. Let's see where the edge is. Here's the edge of the muscle, right? There. There we go. You can see I'm just taking that little piece of connective tissue right off the top. That way I don't damage any blood vessels. And a little bit of this feathery stuff still. Just pushing that back. Okay, I've still got a little bit here. You guys can just go ahead and peel that off. All right. <clears throat> now, you should already have Sartorius done. This one's not quite finished. I'll finish that now. Sartorius from the other side should be done right to the kneecap. So I'm just going to take my scissors and I'm just going to open that up like that. Don't run that in your hand. All right, so Sartorius is done on the back side from when we did the lateral thigh in the last couple of videos. All right, now, there is a seam right here, but don't ignore that. This is one whole muscle, and we want to come down right here. So don't get into this vein yet. So I'm going to, you've seen this technique before. Let me real fast here. I'm just going to make a hole right on the edge of it. And now I'm under it, and you can see I'm just wiggling here. And the vein goes under, so let's be really careful. We want to go over the top of that vein. So now that it's open, I can get enough pressure. You can see I went right over it. Just putting good pressure here. And I'm taking my scissors. I'll open that up a little bit. And you see that muscle? We're going to bring it right out to the edge of the knee. And we're going to cut through that tendon, so don't, don't, don't get all freaked out. We're going to cut right through this tendon. And leave that attached to the other muscle. So I ran my scissors in there. You can see my scissors come out. That's where the line is. Rope. I'm going to just going to worm my way through there. Be very careful not to hit that midline seam. Now I'm all the way under. Good. You can see I'm just working that back, working this completely clear. I'll work this off coming up. I'm going to switch to my scissors here. Just take it right, there's the knee. You can see I went right to it. That's Sartorius done. Okay. The next muscle, or the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to dissect Sartorius here. Not Sartorius, I'm sorry. I'm going to dissect the great saphenous vein. And try to get it out of this connective tissue. And then I'll trim it on both sides. And you can see it comes all the way down here. And I don't want to mess around with it too much. Just enough to get it loose. Now normally I'd be moving this cat, but since we're videoing, I'm just going to leave it still. See, it's in its own connected tissue. And we're just gonna, we're just going to go ahead and leave it, leave it encased. I'm just going to trim it a little bit, just like that. 
That'll, that'll keep it safe. Now we just leave it in that little fat. Now it's out of the way. And there's a little bit of connective tissue on Gracilis here. All right, Gracilis is running like this and then coming out. So we're going to do the same technique. Now on the bottom here, still quite a bit of connective tissue. If you can't see the line, start clearing. Here's the line. That muscle is right. There it is. You can see the gap right here. Just open that up. Now there's another muscle right here. This is semi tendinosis. Don't get into that. I'm just going to take my scissors. Now in this case, the muscle tissue itself ends right there. Tendon keeps going. I don't want to cut the tendon, so I'm just going to cut it out to about right there, and that's going to allow me to get underneath it so the tendon's still intact so it won't come loose. Okay, and I'm just going to work this bottom margin up, and then I'll feed right into the center. There's a lot of connective tissue here. See, I got that completely open right there. There's the edge of semitendinosis right there. Scissors are closed. What I'm going to do is just work my way up here. And you can see I'll come right out on the other side. With a little bit of connective tissue here. And when I clear that, you can see the edge. This is gracilis. You can see the edge of the muscle right there. So watch, if I worm my scissors, just, I'm just wiggling back and forth like this, and I'll come right out onto the margin, and there it is. So I'm just going to come back and clean that up. I'm working that away. There we go. And there you have it. We have the Great Saphenous, Gracilis, and Sartorius. Okay, we'll do some more in the next video.